What's up, Crosspoint family? Welcome to another edition of The Source. We got me and Kim here. Yeah. Kim, it's almost Christmas time. It's crazy. I know. It's practically here. 2023 is in a couple Clear. weeks. Like right here. Yeah. That's Where insane. 2022 was like that. Just like that. I am inevitable. Yeah. Uh, and especially if you were involved with Crosspoint, all the things going on, all that, uh, it's just, man, so quick, but that's crazy. We're excited for Christmas time this year at Crosspoint and just hanging out with family. And oh man, it's gonna be great. I got some Christmas shopping to do a little bit left. Do you have some? I to do too. And I, I think there are some um, people in my home that may have some Christmas shopping to do. You may <laughs> hint, check hint, in with them, hint. right? Kim's gonna send this source video to, right, to yes, family yes. like, hey, uh, it's watch time. this, watch it's this. Here, yeah. But also, there's a slight chance, a slight chance of Christmas snow. I've heard the rumor. Like the lows, good. like 27. There's a 40% 40 percent chance of snow. snow. and Perry, that would be so fun. That would be paradise. Yes. Paradise, that yes. would be. So. It's gonna snow, ho, ho, right here in Dixie. <laughs> Mark your calendars, keep an eye on the weather. We're excited. Uh, but let's back up a little bit. Kim, okay. what, what we got going on this Sunday? So this Sunday we have Discover Kidmen. If you're interested in serving, want to check out uh, different places you can serve in Kidsmen, come on down from 8 to 9 o'clock on Sunday morning. And then Sunday afternoon, the 4th and 5th graders will be in the house for Bible study bash. Absolutely. Ooh. We'll have lunch. We'll um, use the youth rooms upstairs. We've got some fun going on, some Christmas activities. So leave your kids at church if you have fourth and fifth graders. And from an outsider's perspective, I've gone a couple times. It's cool to see the fourth and fifth graders. They've actually invited their friends. Oh, yeah. And then we've seen families come mm -hmm. to cross point yeah. through that. So just, thankful. Just something as simple as lunch and games and a message. Like, so parents, if you have fourth and fifth grader, or if you have friends uh, that, uh, or, or friends of families that have a fourth and fifth grader, invite them to that. Kim and Susan do a great job with that. Don't want to miss out on that. And then uh, next weekend, next Friday, I'm no, excuse me, next Saturday, Saturday and Sunday, we got the Christmas Eve service on Saturday at 4 p.m. We got a lot planned for that, a lot in store. So bring your families. It's a family event. We have um, we have childcare available up to kindergarten, infant through kindergarten, right there. So. Uh, there's that option as well, but just come, bring your family, we'll have candle lighting, we'll have a, a bunch of music, we'll have a message. Uh, be there, invite your friends and family. And then the following morning, Christmas morning, uh, we're gonna have a pre-recorded service for you to enjoy and watch with your family from your home. Uh, it'll be short and sweet, but it'll, it'll be, be awesome. Time. It'll, it'll be time and together. It'll be cool. To there'll be there'll be opportunities to create conversations with your with your kids and just celebrate the story of Jesus' birth together. And so mark your calendars for that. If you haven't already, share it on social media. We got all, all kinds of things coming up on that through Facebook and Instagram. Do that for us. And uh, luckily, uh, <laughs> so to wrap things up, uh, we hope you have a great week. Again, Bible Study Bash, they might be handing out peppermints. Oh, every all kind of candy. Who so knows, yeah. uh, be there no for that. No mistletoe at Bible Study Bash. Though. Okay, okay, no okay. We're not that far. No, no, no. <laughs> That's awesome. So we hope you have a great week and we hope to see you Sunday.